Hey fishing fans, it's Debbie Hansen for TakeMeFishing.org. So you've been learning a lot about fly fishing and you're excited to get out to a local lake or pond near you and catch up some bluegill or some bass on your fly rod. But what's the first thing you need to do when you've got a brand new fly reel? Well, you're going to have to tie your fly line backing onto your fly reel. And to do that, you can use an arbor knot. It's actually a very easy knot to learn. It just basically requires two overhand knots. And I'm gonna show you how to do it right now. So all you need to do is take the tag end of your fly line or fly line backing, and you need to run that around the arbor of your reel. And just make sure you bring it underneath the post on the bottom of the reel. From there, you're going to just tie your overhand knot and then you're going to tie a stopper knot in your tag end and that's just one more overhand knot at the end and that'll prevent your knot from slipping. Okay, from there. You're just going to cinch that first knot down up against the arbor, pull it tight so that stopper knot catches it and prevents it from slipping. You're going to trim off that tag end, and then you're going to start winding your fly line backing onto your reel. That's it. That's all you have to do. Tight lines and happy fishing from TakeMeFishing.org.